It is not only the first day of school for 161,000 students in Wake County, but four schools in the district are opening their doors for the first time. CBS 17's Holden Kerwicki was at Southeast Raleigh Elementary School getting some answers about what the building means for students and the community. As the first students arrived at Southeast Elementary School, they received a welcome from their high school peers that simply can't be beat. <laughs> I didn't expect anything like this. Yeah, I think that was great for the kids coming in this morning, get them ready, get them, you know, active and challenged for the school year. As the first bell rings at Southeast, Good it marks the completion of a dream for parents like Tina Jenkins and Shauna Brake, who believe the school will transform their community and their kids. We're just excited about the being in a new school, being able to start something for the rest of the community. Our schools are really emphasizing how parents can become involved in school, whether it's volunteering, being at school, or things that parents can do at home to support their children. We want to make sure that we are partners with parents in this work. The first of its kind partnership between Southeast and the YMCA will help provide opportunities never before seen in this community. We can have lots of extra curricular activities for him to participate in, something to keep him focused. Push your kids, push them to read, push them to, you know, do their homework after school, you know, because sometimes you know, they want to get on a game. You can't get on a game unless you do your homework and read those books. While well, parents say the new facility makes the grade. Uh, day one, I would give them a perfect 10. Their children are simply trying not to get up in the pomp and circumstance. I'm Dravia Legion. In Raleigh, Holden Kerwick. CBS 17 News.